You were saying something about the planet being in decline? It doesn't look like it, but Havaral is sick. It started here, uncontrolled mutations in organic life, killing some, turning others into poison. We're starting to see the same elsewhere. The planet's ecosystem is crumbling, slowly but surely. It's the monoliths. There are only two of them when there should be three. There's so much life here. Your vault must be working. In some fashion, most likely. But the monoliths are responsible for propagating the vault's instructions across the planet. With only two out of three monoliths working, the instructions are imbalanced. So life is imbalanced. We've never tried asking the sages. There could be something in their oral history. Stars, those superstitious hermits don't care about modern Angara. You know that. You saw the projections for the planet's survival. What do we have to lose? Sages? Oral histories? On Mithrather. That old remnant edifice over there. They trace their families back to a time just after the Scourge. They believe isolation will maintain the purity of the histories by preventing contamination by modern thought. Basic sense. They probably don't even understand or care that Havaral's dying. If asking your sages doesn't work, we'll be back here. So what's the harm in it? The trek up Mithrather's teeming with Remnant. Most of us don't attempt it, but maybe you could do it. Follow the Remnant River and keep your head. I'd hate to hear something terrible happened in pursuit of some ancient legend. What is it? What's wrong with Havaro? The fabric of life is warped. It begins when the flora and fauna mutate. Monstrous, untenable growth ensues. Cancer, corruption, deformity. Things spring up, live and die in a matter of days. The jungle you see now is not the jungle that was two days ago. It will be different again in a week. But everything looks so alive. Havaral produces life in abundance, but it doesn't support life the way it used to. Our ecosystems are failing. Dar Pelev used to be a bustling town, did you know? Now look. We've seen the signs in other parts of the planet. It started, and it'll end like this. I should get going. Stars be bright for you, Pathfinder Rider. I'm here if you need something. Mithrava and the Sages. Tell me more about that. We don't know much. They limit their interactions with everyone else. Even when they need to trade, they say very little. Kiren's probably ashamed I even brought them up. It's just that I once heard... Stars, you'll mock me. I won't mock or tease, you have my word. Please, go on. When I was small, I overheard a story the Sages tell of a man who lived through the Scourge. The Scourge shut down the monoliths on all planets. The vaults stopped working. But this man understood Remnant. They don't know how. And he... did something. He's the reason the vault and the two monoliths worked for as long as they did. And if the tale's true... Maybe they know the location of the third monolith. Yes. Before you got caught in that stasis field, Kieran says you were studying the monolith. What did you learn? There's a vault here. When the scourge hit, it took down some functionality. It's still working to some extent, but with only two out of three monoliths, the system is off balance. And you can't reset it without the third one. Exactly. We hoped that with enough understanding of the monoliths, we could attach our own tech to it, correct it somehow. But progress is slow. Too slow. We can speak more later. I'll be here. I told my colleagues what you did for me. You've made a lot of friends on Havaral, Pathfinder. Any promising leads on lost Angara colonies? A few. We're quietly investigating systems, but it takes time. In the meantime, the recent upheaval exposed ruins we never knew existed down in the valley. 
I'm told there are glyphs that resemble star charts. I'm staying to investigate. I better get to work. Pavara Pathfinder, always good to see you. The monoliths are connected, sending instructions across the planet. But with only two of three, it's like the planet's running a string of code with a chunk missing. Why isn't it just completely broken like the other planets we've seen? All planets start different. If broken, they'd also break differently. Natalis debris, tagged for salvage. Nice work. What do you think this was for? Some kind of aqueduct? Stay alert. We don't know what's down there. We've scanned this area. These structures go deep below the ground. Must be missing something. Guess we'll try again later. Activating automated forward station deployment. Natalis debris, tagged for salvage.
much violence. Arknatanis debris, tagged for salvage. So much violence. indicate Arturian wreckage on Haval has been found. Good. Tell our salvage teams to get busy removing them. Looks like this is our only way in. Uh, this isn't activated. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Got it. Let's give this a try.
creatures up here know anything about the Remnant. It's probably too much to hope they'll share secrets with us. I wouldn't count on it. Got them all. Looks like we need to find another way. I've never been up here before. I have heard of the sages of Mithravar, but never gave them much thought. Why not? Isn't a story worthless if it isn't shared? If the accounts of our past are kept hidden, they may as well not exist at all.
Look at that. that. I'm Ryder, Pathfinder with the Andromeda Initiative, from the Milky Way Galaxy. That does not explain how or why you are able to operate the Remnant doors. It doesn't matter. You must leave. We do not entertain guests here. Havarl's in decline. If you tell me about the lost monolith, I can help fix it, reset the vault. With Ryder's help, Havarl could be healed. Our birthplace restored. Isn't that worth something? It's lost. The memories of its location haven't been reclaimed. On Mithrava, we have accepted Haval's eventual ruin. You're just giving up on your planet? Isn't this your birthplace? Don't you want to save it? A chasm separates want from can. What you ask, no one can give. The memory of the monolith resides within a thread that slipped from our grasp. I'm not sure I follow. We believe in reincarnation. An unbroken thread. There was one, long ago, who had knowledge of the third monolith. Zorai, a champion of the Angara from before the Scourge. Zorai's soul has returned and could be made to remember what it knew. But we have no contact with it. So you're saying there's some way we can make people remember their past lives? Souls retain within families. An object heirloom tied closely to that bloodline could cause memories to resurface. But it's not guaranteed. It has been known to happen on rare occasions in the past with other souls. The only known heirloom of Zarai's family rests in an area with active remnant. No one has survived the journey. But perhaps you... Zorai's soul was reborn in Tavos, who is now a Roka. He recently returned to Haval on a mission. A Roka? Hmm, that'll be difficult. That's why you're here, Jal. They won't like that I'm helping you. This may be a dead end, but we have to try. I will send you the relevant coordinates. We considered Haval a lost cause. But perhaps now, there is hope. Activating automated forward station deployment. Good. I've wanted to talk with you. How are you able to use the remnant? With an artificial intelligence that helps with analysis and translation. So that's the trick. I wouldn't have guessed. Angara, who live close to remnant technology, sometimes learn how to use specific tech. It requires intense concentration, and even if we can make it work, we've never understood how it works. So some of you can use remnant tech, but you don't know how it works? Not all remnant tech, no. Like I said, specific pieces. Take Mithrava, for example. Some of us can operate the security that protects the Sanctuary. The knowledge was passed down through generations. In my case, it took a year to learn how to open a simple door. The difference between knowing you can eat a tree's fruit and understanding why that tree bears fruit. I should be going. Suit yourself.
Christmas lest you wander around with no supervision? You're interrupting our lesson. Could use more interruptions. Sorry, I didn't mean to get in your way. And yet you're still here. As I was saying, the propulsion system that took Bashal to the skies was inspired by four remnant pieces. And that's just one. Much of our progress was prompted by the discovery of remnant artifacts. Where are these artifacts you're talking about? The few that still exist reside in Aya's repository. However, many have been lost. Though there are rumors that as wilds grow wilder, things long buried may be unearthed. It might be wise to study whatever we find. Something out there might give us an edge against the Ket. You believe the Angara learned crucial scientific ideas from the Remnant? It is not just belief. It is a matter of record. Some artifacts were even left in unfinished states, likely to demonstrate how they were put together. I think I'll leave you to your lesson. About time. Data modules contain our histories. They're not for you. Another eidetic trigger, Sam? Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. Yeah, I see. Why do you remain secluded here? The chaos brought on by the Scourge splintered our people and all but destroyed our civilization. Fear took hold. False beliefs about our predicament were seeded and began to influence Angaran thought. In order to maintain the integrity of what they knew to be true, four families left their community to come here. We've remained ever since. Tell me more about your belief in reincarnation. The soul grows through many lifetimes. By seeing through different eyes, it gains wisdom. How do you grow if you don't remember? The growth of the soul is not like the growth of the mind. Memories are not required for the soul to develop. Some even argue that old memories are an unwelcome distraction. A person may become fixated on what was, and their soul consequently stagnates. Tell me more about Zorai. The histories describe him as both scholar and soldier. He traveled the stars and gained knowledge from far-off places. There are even accounts of him having knowledge of the remnant builders and their machines. And the third monolith? Our legends say that Zorai sought out the monoliths after the Scourge came. He died, and it is unclear if he accomplished what he set out to do. You mentioned an heirloom, an object you think will bring Zorai's memories back? Souls return within families. Sometimes the memories of the past can be recalled by an object meaningful to that family. We do not understand why or how this happens and it has only happened on rare occasions. In all cases, the heirloom was ancient. Old Ankara tech from before the Scourge. I'll go. Thank you for speaking to me. Of course.
As death nears, it's harder to face the possibility that I might never see Amara again. Sorry to interrupt, but what's happened? Ahmad is ill. He hasn't got much time left. Ahmad, perhaps this stranger can help. If they've been to Palev, maybe they've seen something. I came from Palev, actually. The little research station? Research station? It used to be a large settlement. A dar. Amara moved them when she left Mithrava. Palav was overtaken by the jungle, remember? A few cycles ago. Everyone left. Oh, yes. I, I remember now. But that means Amara's gone. There might still be a way to track her down. All Dara keep records, don't they? If there was an organized evacuation, they would have documented the process. And the records would state where she went. Pala, that's genius. Where would they keep those records? Likely some kind of administrative building. If it still stands, and the machines still work, it's a slim hope. I don't want to impose, stranger, but I would welcome any news of my sister. We are approaching the location provided by Esmus. Stay sharp, everybody. There's supposed to be remnant crawling all over this place. Undocumented mineral nearby, Pathfinder. This must be what it was like for those ancient Angara, finding strange things in the wilds. It's possible we could discover something new from what you found. We should take it for further analysis.
Shawl, what's your take on all this reincarnation stuff? You're asking if I believe? Yes, sure. Not the way Esmos does.
got it. Looks Insides studded with contacts could have been used for some kind of input. I wish we could study it instead of giving it to this Tavos person. Hostiles ahead! We just want to talk! Hiroka, don't talk to aliens. They come. of these scattered around Avarl. We should pick up as many as we can find. Protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Hostile shuttle incoming.
work. This thing's wrecked. Vines and computers don't mix. Pathfinder, we might be able to reconnect power. Old generator. Might still work. This is it. Amara Dozen. This must be her. They moved her across the planet. Downloading information. Let's get this to a murder. Axel, coming! Axel! Anyone! We're under attack! He's in here, I can hear him. You guys ready? men under my charge and now you crown that achievement by killing me too and you i know your face why do you help these murderers Ryder is an ally he's already helped the scientists at dar palev i know and they should be ashamed after all we've been through with the kit tell me why you come here so i know why i've died Really? Can we take the drama down a notch? Two notches? I don't even have a gun up. I have an artifact or heirloom or something. I'm going to set it down, and I need you to take hold of it. What? And? Is it doing something? Doesn't look like it. Wait. There are things like this in the museum on Aya. Ancient Angaran tech. This fits over a hand. Contacts on the inside for my electric control of... <gasps> what did you do to me? Are you alright? I... know things. The underground monolith. I remember... pain. Desperation. I need you to take me there. Please. If you do this, we can save Havarl. Together. You... you're an alien. I can't trust. Then let me try to earn your trust. Please. Deep beneath the surface, but... but not far. Meet me here. These coordinates will guide you the rest of the way. Just... let me compose myself first. <clears throat> My head feels split in two. Why do you and the rest of the Rokar hate aliens so much? With everything the Ket have done, how can we not? If the Rokar discover I helped you, they will see me as a traitor. I'm sorry for everything the Ket have done. I don't need your apologies or your sympathy. I don't know how or why, but I need to help you find the monolith. Driven to work with you and yet detesting you. My head's a mess. Yes? Esmu said you have the soul of someone they call Zorai. Who's that? The sages believe Zorai had rare knowledge of Remnant. He was alive when the Scourge came. When I was young, they came from Mithraba to speak with my mother. I tried to convince her that I possessed Zorai's spirit. They intended to take me with them. My mother ran them off. They never tried again. Now my mind is filled with images and impressions that aren't mine. Maybe the sages were right. Maybe they were. I suppose it's possible, after all we've seen in Helios already. Knowing why it happens won't help me sow through the feelings in my head. I'll see you at the location you gave me. All right.
Historians believe much of our progress was spurred by such finds. We might benefit from collecting these artifacts. Interesting. It's possible we could discover something new from what you found. We should take it for further analysis. This is coming back to the Tempest. It's possible we could discover something new from what you found. We should take it for further analysis. Good find, Pathfinder. under their noses the whole time. The rest of the remnant in the area may have prevented scans from detecting it. There were remnant machines here. Zorai was able to make them stop. How did he learn to use remnant tech? It's not like there's a manual. Zorai watched the watchers. That's all I'm getting. I'm not sure what it means. The others slept, but Zorai, but I, stayed awake. Unmoving, but seeing. Learning. Sounds like the stasis field around the first monolith. Maybe Zorai was able to shake off the effects. Maybe that changed him. It's yours. It's always been yours. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Organic matter, ancient, reads as Angara. It's Zorai. She died here, before she could get to the third monolith. This... this was me. I would like to spend some time here. But not now. The third monolith can't be far. Come on.
This way? Yes. This is all feeling familiar. At least I think it is. The lost monolith. Finally. Done. You finished what Zorai could not so long ago. I'm sorry, Tavos. No. There's nothing to be sorry about. She didn't complete what she set out to do, but she didn't fail. The two monoliths she reactivated kept her vow going. Without them, the planet would have died. Go on to the vault, Pathfinder. I think I'll stay here a moment. I have a lot to think about. Sam, another memory prompt? One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. I feel as though I know this place. Or am I fooling myself because I want to remember? Okay, Remnant Vault. Let's get this place up and running.
need to repeat the console to activate the purification field, Pathfinder. That's it. Several interface connections converge here. I will highlight the ones you need. There must be a trick to this. Let's give it a try. Gets us a step closer. This console will activate the purification field. You may want to sweep the area. Before this place tries to kill us, you Back up. We did it. 
That's a jest. It can't be. That's not a jest. The vault going through a reset would explain all the readings. I can't wait to hear all about this. Come back to Palar. We've a lot to discuss. Pathfinder, the organic life on Havaro has begun to stabilize. It appears the vault is performing biological repairs. Imagine what we'll see here in a few years. An alien, able to use remnant. Never thought I'd see such a thing. My aunt had a remnant artifact she learned to open and close. Some alien was talking to me. It took her many, many years to, to achieve it. I'm concerned. She was never able to do it reliably. It took a great deal of concentration. And she couldn't explain how she was doing it. Pathfinder Rider, you have done something remarkable here today. Succeeded where Zorai failed. Esmus, what are you doing down here? Renewing old bonds. Talking to you was enlightening. I saw an alien working for us when we had given up. We have isolated ourselves for too long. Perhaps there is a balance we can find. We all need to find balance, I think. Apparently, I just walked into a party. I've learned a lot in a short time. The Rokar wants simple solutions, but nothing is ever simple or certain, is it? I wish those that were killed could have realized this. But after everything I've seen, I have to hope that they aren't lost forever. This curious memory transfer. Reincarnation. Whatever it might be, I aim to devote resources to studying it. Maybe one day we'll find the truth buried deep within our superstitions. That was kind of heartwarming to see. There has been healing today, Havaral. The rifts between my people and your to thank. There is some space here at Dar Pelev, and we'll need extra hands to monitor Havaral's situation. Will you extend an invitation to your people? We'd welcome anyone who can help. I'll pass it along. Then I'll leave you. I have some numbers to analyze. Can you believe it? For the first time in years, they excite me. My sister. Carla was right. They documented everything. Your sister was moved across Havarl. This data drive should have the specifics. Thank you. With all this information, I could see Amara again. But the thought of leaving frightens me. This is my home. If I leave, I abandon my duties. What if I never get to come home again? Everyone gets scared. It passes. Amara's your sister. And home is often a person, and not a place. I will swallow my fear. Thank you for this. For helping an old man. <laughs> Thank you, Raida. Paula said you were ill? Yes. An incurable condition that occurs frequently in Mithrava's population. We lose the ability to effectively absorb sunlight. The Angara rely on sunlight for bioenergy. Without it, we weaken. Eventually, my body will be unable to sustain brain function. I'll fall into a coma and die. Tell me more about your sister, Amara. We were born here, but she grew up and disagreed with Mithrava's principles argued against our seclusion. When she could not sway the others, she left. 
choosing to join Angara society. It's been over 30 years now. There were others in our litter, but it was different with Amara and I. We were Vasta Nari, a shared soul. I have a twin. It's not exactly the same thing, but I think I know what you mean. Family, but closer than most. <laughs> Perhaps you understand a little. I'll leave you now. I'm grateful for what you've done. This life is still off limits to you. Davos has come to us. Did you know that, Pathfinder? He has surrendered to a period of peace and solitude to organize his thoughts. What's next for him? That depends on him. Haval owes you a debt, Pathfinder. But your presence upsets many of the people in my charge. I hope you will respect our wishes and limit your visits here. You spoke before about reconsidering your seclusion. Perhaps we will learn to communicate with the outside world again. But it will take time. We cannot overturn generations of tradition in one night. Now, if there's nothing else... I'll go. Thank you for speaking to me. Of course. Leaving Avaral. Bridge is yours, Pathfinder.